Yo, what's going on, ladies and gentlemen? Back once again, another daily motivational video. I'll be bringing you uh, these kind of videos daily. Um, I've just recently dropped a couple of vlogs, dropped a a studio session. Uh, my young, my young bro, my young boy, sixty seconds. You know, recently. Um, got in touch with uh, touchlines producer and yeah we've been we've been cooking he's working on his EP so look out for that we've shot some visuals um, yeah and there's this 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 quite a few stuff that we have going on if you go and check the video out you 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 literally see that there's a couple of jams that we've been working on um, and yeah speaking of 60 check out my other vlog meet my younger brothers um, that's just another video where you know I got my boys just talking, you know, um, knowledge and sets as we always do. And um, yeah, watch out for the vlogs that I'm gonna keep dropping, the content that I'm gonna soon drop. The podcast is coming, and there's just so much more. So, subscribe to the channel, like, comment, let's engage, let's keep in touch. And in this video, I actually got this title or um, concept of this video from my from one of my friends, uh, Bafana. Shout out Kataza, shout out my homie. And yeah, man, activate your hustler's muscle. Now, I'm sure he has a completely different um, perception of you know reason or explanation of what that means for him but for me i mean if you if we're going to talk about business if you think about you get paid for what you do when it comes to a business if you treat your your business like a hobby you get paid like it's a hobby if you treat your business like a business you get paid like it's a business and that is a term that i heard a lot in network marketing and i mean if we're talking about being business-minded business-centered and just being an all-round entrepreneur and if you're someone that's chasing that full-time we know that that can bring what people are actually chasing which is freedom now we see this freedom as 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 time that we can spend doing things that we love you know if you talk about watching YouTube, watching podcasts, uh, watching movies, playing video games, um, going out with the friends and the homies and the girls. And we know that now that you have a business and this business is giving you some sort of freedom. If you're somebody that probably um, walked away from a nine to five or you're just somebody that just went head on into the business world, the business world can bring a lot of time on your hands and if you carefully if you don't carefully realize that that freedom is why most people fail people fail because they don't do the work people fail because they now have freedom and they spend time watching podcasts they spend time going out they spend time doing nothing instead of doing the work now i just mentioned if you might be somebody that has probably walked away from a nine to five then you know like myself you know that a nine to five can teach you a lot about the business world it can teach a lot about yourself it can teach a lot about being accountable being punctual um working with people being able to be compassionate, considerate, and all those things, all those elements, all those um, things that have to come in when you have to deal with people and if you're working a job. And that's exactly how you should treat your business because you are leaving a nine to five and you are going into the business world. You have the freedom. And now the mindset is saying, I have the freedom. I don't have to work when I don't want to. I don't have to show up when I don't need to. And that's the mindset that if you don't change that, if you don't realize that, if you don't take notice of the fact that 
you really don't have freedom you have to work for it and if you treat your business like a job i mean what happens if you don't show up for the job or if you don't show up for work at your job what happens if you go out with your friends instead of coming to the job or coming to work what happens if you don't show up and you decide to watch podcasts the work doesn't get done and guess what happens if if you do all those things you get fired you literally get fired so why not apply all the the morals and ethics and the practices in the business and treat your business like a job and activate your i mean if we go back to activating your 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 hustler's muscle that means that you will always show up when you don't need when you don't want to you will do the work when you feel tired you will activate your hustler's muscle you will keep going and you'll keep doing the reps and you'll continue to show up and the whole mindset it's a very good mindset guys to to think that one day i will have all the riches i'll have all the time i'll have all the money i'll have all the freedom i won't have a job i won't have somebody that i have to report to i don't have uh there's nothing that's on my shoulders basically and yeah guaranteed given that that you don't have that when 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 you're not in a job you know when you're when you're independent when you're free when when you're doing it by yourself when you're on your own too it all depends on you and you have to show up so i encourage you guys to and also if you are thinking of taking that step taking the step of moving from your 9 to 5 or moving from your job and moving from what is cultural if i can say that and moving to something more unfamiliar something more taboo something more uh, something that you're not familiar with actually which is going to be the unknown because you don't know what it's going to be like but as long as you can apply the principles of knowing that at a job if i was supposed to show up at 7 a.m then i will show up at 7 a.m for my business at a job if i am going to be accountable for my actions and i'm going to literally be responsible for everything that i need to do and see it through then do the same in the business take it as serious as a job i mean if you can take a job seriously then surely you can take a business seriously so stop thinking that you have the freedom to just lull because that's why people don't get things done because now they think that i'm in the business world and there's no one literally behind you holding you accountable no one saying i need reports i need figures i need numbers no one is you are literally the business you are literally the billboard of your business and it takes reps it takes repetition it takes you doing it over and over and over again as mundane as it will seem at some point you have to continue doing it as mundane as a job is so will a business be it will just be the same thing but you have to have to show up you have to keep growing you have to keep showing up for as long as you can so i encourage you guys to develop that mindset and continue to push forth even when you don't feel like that tell yourself that i have to show up even if you don't want to go tell yourself that i have to be there and put in the numbers and at the end of the day only you will be satisfied because if you don't do it then at the end of the day you are left to be exposed and accountable for what you have not done so keep on putting in the work and let's get it